Kanye West announced he was running for president in 2020 during the MTV VMAs on Sunday. The bold declaration came at the end of an epic acceptance speech for a Lifetime Achievement Award. Taylor Swift honored the star with a gushing introduction that was a nod to their first encounter. The 38-year-old famously rushed the stage when Taylor Swift accepted an award back in 2009, claiming that his friend Beyoncé was a more worthy recipient. Kanye's announcement that he would run for president comes almost 10 years to the day that he attacked President George Bush on national television during a live segment. On September 2, 2005, Kanye and Mike Myers appeared at a telethon benefit for the victims of Hurricane Katrina, and almost immediately Kanye appeared to go off script. I hate the way they portray us in the media, said Kanye. If you see a black family, it says, they're looting. You see a white family, it says, they're looking for food. And you know that it's been five days because most of the people are black. Myers took over soon after that, but when he went to take a breath at one point, Kanye said, George Bush doesn't care about black people. He then walked off stage. President Bush later called the comment one of the most disgusting moments of his presidency. In a 2010 interview with Today, West said, I would tell George Bush in my moment of frustration, I didn't have the grounds to call him a racist. I believe that in a situation of high emotion like that we as human beings don't always choose the right words.